I am adventurous, but yet at the same time, I'm also a very firm father. Yes. I think it has to be the very, very first day that I become a father. And uh, that's when Kristen was born. Yeah, the day when I was in the hospital with my wife and there she is, this little bundle of joy God has given me. It's like, whoa, the joy is uh, tremendous. And just looking at a small little thing, you say, you know, you want to just throw out your heart, your, you want to give your best to protect her and to provide for her and to love her and to care for her, you know, and everything, yeah. So, and of course, I'm very, very blessed, you know, I've got four kids. So after Kristen is Jairus and then Wei and then Elliot. So all four of them gives me a lot of joy. I think the greatest challenge for us, and especially for modern day fathers, would be, you see, we are from different generations. We are digital migrants. All right, so when I was a kid, I was a kampung boy. I ran about and all that, right? And then suddenly there is computers in the 80s. So I migrated into a new lifestyle. I started learning about computers and all that. But it was still not uh, native, you know, I'm still not native. I'm still not born into it. Whereas for our children, they're born into this digital world. So they are native people of the digital world. So we think very differently, we see things very differently and the association with the electronics for them and for us is very different. So for us, it's how to guide them and how to teach them. I want my children to experience the world. That's why they know me as the adventure, adventurous daddy. I want to bring them out and show them the world, you know? Yeah, yeah. We always have conditions. You do your homework well, I will reward you. You do this well, I will reward you, you know, whatever. Um, but how to show grace, how to love unconditionally, how to be more patient, how to be more understanding. I think these are all things that a father will constantly have to learn. I think this lesson will be all the way until the day I don't become a father, which is the day I die. Not to take merits and credits for yourself when it comes to teaching your children, whether they are good or they are bad, and also don't take the blame to yourself as well. But do your best and love them uh, with all your heart. Yeah.